Hello gamers, it's Ron from Gamers334. I'm here today to bring you some World of Warcraft PvP gameplay as well as uh, talk about some things, things that are going on, things with constructive gamers, all, all of the above. Um, this video is mainly going to be me doing yeah some PvP battlegrounds, and I got a Raffi Basin. Why did I almost I almost said um, Alterac Valley? That's why you heard me stutter there for a second. Don't ask me why I was thinking. But anyways, um, so WoW right now is actually uh, getting real fun. Um, I know with the Mr. Pandaria launch, uh, a lot of people stopped playing the game. A lot of people said it was getting too stupid. After this launch, let's put it this way, I think. If, if you play World of Warcraft, you know exactly what happened. If you don't play, I'll fill you in a little. Um, World of Warcraft... The, the servers crashed constantly uh, between the amount of people being on at the same time and the DDoS attacks. Well, that's apparently. I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, but it, it was overall overall very fun. The This this X-Pack has actually brought a lot to the game that I enjoy. I'm sure others enjoy out there, too. Um, but, uh... That's, that's another thing I would like to talk about too right now. It's not constructive gamers. Uh, myself and Matt, you know, as you know, have worked on uh, games in the past. Um, we have two of them available right now as demos on our website, uh, possibly even for sale later in the future. Also on the website, uh, and one of you know one of them's a uh, zombie top-down shooter. And the other one is a uh, platformer called Happy Gems, where you're a uh, little smiley face that jumps around. You have to collect all the gems to move on to the next uh, level. But it is actually difficult. It is. <laughs> it's not something you think would be for a little kid. Trust me. You go play this and test it out. You'll be uh, swearing and cussing at me faster than you can even say super califragilistic And um, it's just. It's it's actually really difficult. I've had people tell me that it's way too hard but you know what I can finish it uh, Matt can finish it well kind of uh, he gets so far and then just kind of stops I guess but um, it doesn't matter the point is it's finishable it's playable no matter what uh, if you want to go check it out I'll leave a link in the description for uh, Gamers334 website which will have constructive gamers in there as well all the constructive gamers and all Gamers334 things are within the website uh, those games are not what I'm here to talk to you about today. Uh, the game I'm here to talk to you about, really, is a jump scare game we are currently working on called a, um, Staying at Schlenko's House. Now, the whole point of the game is that there was a man named John Schlenko who worshipped, uh, the devil. And he had many followers. You could say he was the leader of a cult. Uh, he... Uh, sat, he did some blood sacrifices and everything to a point where uh, and this guy's gonna completely run out of the way what a wuss uh, sorry about the interruption Some people just obviously don't know how to... Wow, this, this, this is going bad. <laughs> we don't even have blacksmith. But anyways, um, he allowed a demon to enter this world. Uh, the demon slaughtered all of his followers and possessed John himself, ended up killing him. And now, uh, the demon and uh, all of John's followers, including John, are trapped in that house. And uh, it's, it's legend says that anyone that goes into the house never leaves with either their body or their soul. Um, it, so it's, it's pretty, um, it can be pretty terrifying. Uh, it's, it's, our, it's our first attempt at a 3D game. It's first person, you don't see the body at all. Uh, you just pretty much walk through the house, uh, find certain artifacts, and pray that you make it to the next night. Uh, when you survive all those different uh, times, uh, then you will 
beat the game. If you don't survive, well, you're in for quite a few jump scares. I'm not gonna lie. Um, <laughs> we actually we work we're working on a 2D version of the game to start with. Actually, uh, that was. Um, that was pretty fun. That was actually kind of scary too. Uh, just just the jump scare aspect, not so much the graphics. Uh, the graphics on the 3D one are actually slightly better. Um, it's the same like sprite uh, for the demon, uh, but it's it's pretty cool. Uh, it's it's pretty cool. I think it is. Once Matt uh, play tests it and everything, I'm pretty sure he'll back me up on saying it's cool. Uh, well, not cool, but it, it's it can be fun. Um, because the the element of surprise is the element of surprise in the game. You have no clue where the demon is, and you have no clue where he'll show up. But it is it's pretty fun. I I enjoy it, and I'm not saying that because I uh, am I'm, I'm the one creating it. I'm saying that as a gamer myself. Uh, if I didn't really enjoy it, trust me, I would leave that project to the dust and work on something completely different, and uh, we wouldn't be talking about staying at Schlenko's house right now. Uh, we'd be talking about um, My Little Pony Island Adventure. <laughs> Obviously not. Well, Matt might. Brony. Eh, he'll watch this probably and be mad a little bit, but you know what? It's bound to show up at some point. Wow, why am I getting wrecked in this battleground? Jeez. Um, with, uh, the new computer, uh, for, with Matt's new computer, uh, we should be bringing you some, wow, some, uh, Gary's Mod, um, gameplay as well, online, we'll be, you know, doing TTT, uh, we'll be doing Prop Hunt, all, all that good stuff. Um, it will probably be doing, uh, Probably be doing some uh, WoW gameplay as well. Um, I know maybe some Minecraft. Actually, I know we'll be doing some Minecraft, and we'll be posting that as well. We'll be have you know it'll, it'll be all of our different uh, point of views and vantage points and all that kind of stuff because you know we're getting more into this. We're uh, uh, finding the software to do this stuff. Um, as you can see uh, right now, there's no um, uh, camera filming this it's actually a recording software uh... it's actually um, what wow this hunter really needs to lay the hell off uh... it's called um... obs open broadcaster software it's the same thing that uh... people use on twitch all that kind of stuff um, it's it's pretty nice uh... it took us a few tries to get it right and to actually make it work but other you know it's it's it's, it's pretty good if uh, you're interested in making YouTube videos yourself, you can uh, go go download it. Uh, just look up um, Open Broadcaster Software or OBS in Google. Um, yeah, so uh, Gary's Mod, I'm trying to think. Uh, Minecraft, wow. Um, who knows? We might, we might bring you some other gameplay. Uh, make, sure, make sure you check out... Um, I'm not gonna let this battleground finish on this video because I know it's going to be a loss, and I'd rather you can just not see it and just kind of imagine it. <laughs> um, also, uh, be sure to check out our website. Uh, we have demos for our games, and once uh, sh um, staying at Shalenko's house is um, playable, uh, we'll have it up there for beta testing, and you can actually send us feedback and all that on there. Um, only about the beta testing, uh, not about. Um, any of the demo games uh, that is already uh, done um, just check it out uh, give this video a like give other videos likes go check out different uh, videos that we've done uh, it, I don't, I'm not sure we did we did a huge deleting spree so it's um it's probably a lot more bare now than it was before um, if it is, well, I'm sorry. There's not too much, but you know, I think I think what you do find you'll enjoy. Uh, listen to Matt's squeaker voice, because <laughs> when we started this channel, he had quite a high-pitched voice, <laughs> and um, I didn't have as high of a pitch. But uh, I, I guess you could consider it a high pitch, but it wasn't. It tr truthfully wasn't. Um, yeah, just uh, check everything out, and I'll. Uh, I'll see you in the next video, which will probably be in a few days, maybe 
It, it might be a week from now. It all depends. Um, but expect some, some more videos definitely uh, in February. I'll see you then. Keep on gaming.